Hey guys, in this video, we're going to be doing an unboxing slash first impression of Zerjov's More Than Words. I'm excited guys. So if you want to find out all about this fragrance or maybe some part of it, please stay tuned. Welcome back guys. Today we're going to be unboxing Zerjov's More Than Words and I'm going to be sharing my experience with you guys. But before I jump in, if you're new to my channel and you like fragrances and you enjoy fragrance content just like me, please subscribe to my channel and also feel free to like and share my videos. So jumping in guys, this is Zerjov's More Than Words and guys, I am excited. I've had this fragrance for a while, maybe a month, but I just haven't had the time to record a video for you guys. So, we're gonna start with the presentation. And as we go, I'm gonna let you know a few things that I know about this fragrance. So it comes in a box like this, a white box. I like Zerjov because of uh, the way, you know, the packaging basically. This kind of uh, bottles or this line actually, the way they have them, you know. This is how the fragrance comes, guys. So we're going to be unboxing. There we go, guys. You got to love Zerge of guys, even from the box, the packaging, you can tell this is high. This is quality stuff. This is high quality stuff. So yeah, I love this. So the fragrance sits in this beautiful casket like I like to call them just like that so a little bit about this fragrance guys this is more than words and this is part of the JTC collection the join the club collection I own one of the fragrance from this collection which is ivory roots which I believe is inspired by traveling and adventure but this one is inspired by writers and poets so I'm excited guys I've done a little bit of research but I'm excited because also I don't know what this one smells like. So let's go. So I'm gonna do one spray on my wrist here and then I'll just tell you what I pick up from a quick sniff. Woo. Wow. So upon first sniff, I can tell you this one has oud in it. It's got rose for sure. And it's got some something fruity. Yeah, it's got something fruity. And uh, I'm not sure what else I can pick up from just doing a quick sniff here. Yeah. And the opening is quite harsh or quite in your face with the oud. And of course with the rose. I haven't looked up the notes, but guys, I can tell you this one smells like high quality stuff. This one is a, this is a big boy fragrance. <laughs> yeah, this is a big boy fragrance. And I believe this is a shared fragrance, so it goes both ways. It's unisex, even from what I can pick up here. I can see a lady wearing this one and I can also see a guy wearing this one. This is a fragrance I would wear for sure. Yeah. But guys, am I really blown away? No. I have a few fragrances that are in this ballpark already. So these would be perfect for someone who likes oud and rose because to me this is a perfect oud and rose combo fragrance. From what I can pick up, yeah, the oud is there, the rose is there, and plus it's got a, a different twist, I guess, with the fruity touch and then maybe some other notes thrown in. But uh, I'm not entirely wowed by this fragrance, like I said, I don't think it's unique enough. But then it was launched in 2012, so who knows? So, guys, I think it's settled down now and it's more of a 
a rose I can pick up the rose now the rose is coming to play more and something here is a little sweet not the fruity kind of sweet but something here is a little sweet to my nose but yeah this is a rose and oud combo basically if you like that kind of fragrance which I do like I have a couple of them so I'm happy to have this one and add this one to my collection even though I think it's not entirely new which is okay but uh, yeah I'm also interested to see how this one would perform but from what I can pick up here this is maybe for the cooler weather months maybe for the winter or the fall that's where I'm kind of seeing this to be working this is not a good summer fragrance for sure it might be too heavy but yeah it has this vibe of luxury and high quality this is a niche fragrance guys so this smells like niche proper niche fragrance i like it and i'm going to be testing it in the next couple of days to see how well this one performs on my skin so guys tell me what you think about this fragrance do you know zergios more than words do you like zergios fragrances do you like oud and rose combo fragrances let me know in the comment section and also let me know what your favorite Zerja fragrance is. I'm excited to hear what you guys think and I'm excited to get a conversation going with you guys in the comment section. Yeah, guys, there you have it. That's all I have for you in this video. And that was More Than Words by Zerja. Pretty good fragrance. Yeah. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for sticking till the end of this video. Please, if you're new once again to my channel, subscribe to my channel and also feel free to like and share my videos you can also follow me on twitter and instagram i'm gonna link my handles in the description box guys i'm gonna see you in my next video and until then please stay safe and bye bye